Hello and welcome to this Power BI tutorial. We are continuing our tutorial series and uh, we have learned quite a few things in that series. Now there are few operations which are there part of the data transformation uh, which are required sometimes and they come pretty handy. So we are going to take uh, some of uh, these operations and see how to uh, use those. So let's get a data. We will get a pivoted data first of all and try to unpivot that. So we will go. We will have this uh, Excel sheet from where we will take the pivot data. So I have this sheet, pivot data sheet. Uh, from this, I'm going to take a pivoted data. So let it load. So I have this pivoted data. So uh, it is having uh, data both uh, uh, in the rows and the columns. And this is not ideal for any uh, business analytics uh, or business analysis uh, uh, project. So what we have need to do is uh, we need to transform it. So instead of loading the data, uh, we will directly go to the data transformation mode. Uh, there is a button out here, transform data. So let's click on that and it will open us uh, uh, data transformation mode, uh, also known as edit query mode. And this is also known as power private. Uh, so now we are there and what we need to do is we need this column as intact, but these columns we need uh, maths, physics, chemistry and English in columns. So what we are going to do is we are going to select these columns which we need uh, as uh, uh, un to be unpivoted and then uh, we select these uh, all the columns uh, we could have I have so the way to select is uh, click on one of the column and then press either shift or control if you press control you have to do it one by one I press shift and I simply click on the last column because all of them are in one sequence so I can do that and then go to the transformation tab and you uh, will find these icons so there is one icon which is unpivot and right now I'm going to click on unpivot and I will use unpivot columns. So it has given me and uh, you know Power BI is able to detect one kind of unpivoting is there and it has done it. And now I do the renaming so I will call it subject and these are marks. So now uh, once this is done I have to go to home tab and say file close and apply. And these changes will be applied to my file. And once these changes are applied, we can actually go ahead and look the table and this is what we wanted. Uh, so this is the way you can actually unpivot your data. Pretty handy uh, function which is there available uh, in uh, data transformation mode. Do try that. Thanks for watching this video.